Oh, it smells so good. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Amanda Rose. And in today's video, I am gonna jump on the train. I said I wouldn't do it. Honestly, wasn't even really sure if I was gonna do it. But I'm gonna be showing you guys what I got for Christmas. It is gonna be a little later because like I said, I was really indecisive on if I wanted to do it or not. I don't want you guys to think that I'm showing off at all. This is not what it's for. The reason why I love watching these is because I can get ideas of what maybe I would want or that someone else would want or something that I would just want to buy myself. This is going to be a culmination of stuff that I got from my sisters, my husband, my kids, all that stuff. We're going to start out with some of the bigger things that I got for Christmas. I love home stuff. I love cooking stuff, cooking gadgets, anything that can help with baking, cooking, I love doing all of that. So the first thing that I got for Christmas is a KitchenAid. My husband got me the, I think it's like the mint colored KitchenAid. I'm not quite sure what color it is. I've already used it. I freaking love it. It is heavy duty. It works really well. I have already used it for making my garlic mashed potatoes and it whipped it up so fast. I was so excited to get it. I cannot wait to use it for other things. I am going to be making cookies again probably tomorrow. I'm going to do uh, my macadamia nut white chocolate cookies. <sighs> Those were a hit and that's probably why I have so much weight gain right now. I do want to get more attachments at some point to make pasta or ravioli. I'm just really excited to play with it some more. The next thing that I got, I've been hinting to you guys that this is something that I've been wanting to do for a while now. Even though my videos don't do very well, I still like to document a lot of things. So for Christmas, my husband got me the Canon G7X Mark II vlogging camera or camera. You can use this for beauty as well, but he got me this camera. I've already opened it up and I'm really, really excited to play with this. I have not used it yet because I wanted to wait to do this video. It is is really tiny compared to my Canon that I have. When I was vlogging, driving across America, my Canon ADD that I have right now is just way too big. I could barely hold it up. The tripod that I had is just too big. This is the camera. It's really small. It is so compact. I love it though. And then it's got the screen that flips up. So when you vlog this way, you can see yourself. When you turn it on, it's fairly small and then you can flip this up and yeah I think it's really cool I love it a lot I need to get a case for this I still have to play around with this a little bit but I'm really really excited to vlog and just to show you guys my life if y'all are interested I don't know let me know if you guys do want to see it I may just start a separate channel for it because I know that I feel like a lot of people that come here to watch my beauty stuff are solely here for beauty stuff and they don't want to see the mom stuff or the family stuff so just let me know in the comment section down below if you guys do want to see real life stuff and the next thing that I got is kind of like, okay, it wasn't my gift. It's actually to my husband, my sister, and our husband got this for my husband, but we both use it. We both, I keep saying we both, it's, it's his. My husband got a weighted blanket, so it's really good for anxiety, and it's by Luna. I'm not exactly quite sure why it helps with anxiety, but I can tell you that it really does help. It was New Year's Eve. And we were just hanging out, all of a sudden my anxiety started kicking in, my heart was racing once I went to bed. And we put that weighted blanket over us. I was good to go and I passed out so fast. I thought initially that having a weighted blanket over you would be super uncomfortable, but it really isn't. You just have to put it over your duvet or whatever blanket that you usually sleep with. And I am telling you, it really does help and it's heavy as hell it's like 60 pounds folding that thing up and moving it around is no joke but it is amazing i am going to get into clothes now the next thing that i got is this wrangler flannel top it's a men's top this is in a size medium so i just usually wear a shirt underneath it and then i roll it up it is like literally you guys i'm not kidding i have worn this thing probably about six times already. I've worn it almost every single day. It is so warm. It is, I think it was only like $24 or something like that on Amazon. And I am freaking 
in love. It is so warm and so comfortable, so cute. And by the way, I will be linking everything down below so that you guys can click on it and check it out. The next two things that I got from my husband, I've already worn them both. I've washed them both. These are the Zella Live In Leggings. These are the high-waisted ones. I just noticed that they changed their logos. I think the last pair of Zellas that I got was probably about a year ago. But yeah, these are the high-waisted ones. It doesn't have the X in the background anymore. For the newer Zellas, the pocket is a lot deeper so you can probably fit like a small phone in there or something or your AirPods. I usually stick my AirPods in there. I got these in size medium. I freaking love these. I literally live in these just like the description is. I'm so glad that he got me two pairs of these because like I said, since being home all the time, this is literally all that I wear. The next thing that I got... <laughs> There's another pair of leggings my sister got this for me. She would always talk about these leggings and how soft they were and every time she'd walk by they just look super comfortable and she had me feel them I'm like oh my god these are like butter. So she got me a pair for Christmas and these are by Aerie which is American Eagle. These are the leggings here. They're kind of small but I'll be losing a little weight here in a little bit. These are pretty short. They're shorter than the Zella ones. This is the back. I don't know if you guys can see that. And then the next thing that I got was from my sister as well. So she ordered a whole bunch of these and I was just like, I want that too. So she ended up getting it for me. This is a sweatshirt. It's like an oversized sweatshirt by American Eagle. It's the jegging fit, so it's gonna be longer. This is in size medium. This is a camo. It's very long, and then it's got slits on the side, which is really cute. Um, but yeah, this is fairly long and I like how oversized it is. It is soft and it is really smooth inside. Really excited to wear that. And then the next thing I got was from my other sister. She had asked me to give her my top three things that I wanted for Christmas. And even though we haven't really been out a lot, I still wanted something that was a little different than what I usually get. She got me the Sam Edelman Flint Gray Coat. I don't know exactly what style it is, but it's just a puffer. It's got the black detail in here, and I love that it has the matching black detailing here. Just a regular puffer. It isn't as thick as I thought it would be, but it's still really nice. You can also take the hood off. You can just zip it right off, and it'll just be a regular puffer, which is also what I really liked about it. And then you've got the faux fur up here, and I like that it has the black in here as well to match the zipper. I am very, very big on detail, and I love it when things do match that's just how I've always been I can't like when the whole color block thing happened in like 2008 2009 I, I could not do it I couldn't wear like half solid red shirt and a half solid purple shirt with like blue pants I just I couldn't do it I'm really excited to wear this I'm gonna say I'm excited about everything I'm just I'm just forewarning you guys. The thing that I got was from my mother-in-law. I thought that this gift was so freaking cool. She gifts me a lot of her stuff that she's had for a really long time. So she gifted me this Stuart Weitzman snakeskin crossbody. So you can see that it says Stuart Weitzman made in Spain. So you've got a good amount of space in there if you want to put your phone in there, if you want to put some lipstick, your wallet, this is really good. I do like the gold detailing on here. I wear gold a lot. It's pretty much vintage, you guys. I love it. It is so freaking cute. I'm so excited to wear it. I would probably wear this like all black all white. I don't know. I'm not quite sure. It's really cute. And then on top of that, she had put something inside. The next thing that I got from her, she got me the Stila Stay All Day Shimmer Liquid Lipstick in Beso Shimmer. Now listen to this, you guys. Some of you may not like this because of who it is, but I honestly don't really care. I want you guys to hear this. It's really sweet. So she said, AOC wore this lipstick when she stood up in the house and called out the rep who called her an effing B-I-T-C-H. This put his statement on record. You go, girl. This, she claims to be her power lipstick. I thought that was awesome and very thoughtful. Look at how pretty that is. Nice shimmer. Oh my God, look at that color from far away. That is so pretty. Okay, that is gorgeous. And the next items that we got are all going to be in the beauty type realm, I guess you can say. My sister got this for me. I am super 
super excited to play with this you guys i had to actually go into this and make sure that nothing was broken because i remember my son throwing this gift around everywhere and it was broken so i had to clean it off a little bit and it's beautiful so my sister got me the urban decay stoned vibes palette i'm so freaking excited to play with this the colors in here are freaking gorgeous i'm taking it right now and i'm going to swatch it for you guys i'm going to swatch a few colors look at that packaging it is just it's just like all the crystals that i have it's sparkly it's celestial it's just oh this is so pretty this is the palette there isn't one shade that i'm not excited to work with i'm excited to work with all of these shades from the blue to the green let me just go ahead and swatch so i'm gonna swatch opal aura which is kind of like that light blue shade and then we're gonna do vibes it's kind of like a purple and then bloodstone maybe i'll do another one Ooh, bloodstone is kind of like max club if you guys remember that one it's got like a brown base with a green overlay and then we'll do oho oh my I'm gone, you guys. This is the blue. And there's this one. Oh my god. And this one. Oh my god. Look at how pretty that is. And that one I'm really excited to play with. So be on the lookout for that review. I already did open it up. It's from the Sephora 25 Days or 24 Days of Christmas. Yeah, 24 Days of Christmas. So I pretty much already opened everything up. And it came with a lot of um, like minis. It came with some nail polish, skincare masks, three lipsticks, a liquid lipstick, some hair stuff. So I got a whole bunch of stuff in that. Oh, and some like uh, bath bombs. My sister got me the Tatcha Pore Perfecting and Protecting Set. This comes with a lip balm. It comes with the cleanser, water cream, and the liquid silk canvas. I've been wanting to try this for a really long time. You guys don't even know how many times I have put this in my Sephora cart and taken it back out probably about 10 times. I'm not shitting you like so many times. The next thing that I got is by Philosophy. This is the ultimate age defying set. Time in a bottle is one of my most favorite vitamin C serums for your face. If you want to get rid of age spots, if you want to get rid of the wrinkles, if you want your face to look nice and fresh, this is definitely the thing to go with. I'm actually really glad that she did get this set for me. She usually gets me this set every year but I love philosophy for the face and then we have the micro delivery exfoliating face wash this stuff is amazing as well my husband uses it for his blackheads on his nose I don't use it as much but this is pretty much for him and then the last thing in this gift set is I think it might be like a cream it's this guy down here so I'm really excited to try that as well you guys already know that I love their moisturizer and their nighttime moisturizer it's just it's amazing. My sister also got me the Purity set. I rant and rave about it all the time. You guys already know that I love the Purity cleanser. So we have the One Step cleanser. It is a travel size. This is a clay mask. So I haven't tried the mask and I haven't tried the moisturizer. If I do love them, I will obviously get the full size version with any of these guys that she got me. And the next thing that I got is actually right behind me. My husband got me this little makeup organizer. I had it in the Amazon cart. As you guys can see, I have these two back here. I got these at the container store. They are glass. They're gorgeous. I just wanted something that I could put on here that like serve as like my favorites or what I'm going to use all the time so that I can kind of organize everything when I do do my favorites. There are so many different compartments. It's really easy to work with. I literally need like a lot, a lot of storage and I'm glad that he got that for me. I don't know. I can't remember who this was from. I don't know if it was from my husband or if it was from one of my sisters. I've been wanting to like get into this so bad. They got me the Versace Bright Crystal set. I think this is the biggest one that, they, no, it's not the biggest one that they have. This is the 3.4 ounce Odo Toilette. I believe it only comes in Odo Toilette. And then we've got the little travel size. It's super cute. The body lotion and the shower gel. I don't know if I'm going to be using the shower gel because it might not be good for my eczema on my elbows and stuff like that. I don't know. We will see. What is this? Three ounces. I was watching another YouTuber a long time ago. Her name is Riley Beauty, Riley's World. Rise rise where i can't she changed her name but she had this on her channel and i was like oh my god i used to wear that back in the day like i had one that was like 1.7 ounces and i used to keep it in my car and i would just 
spray it on before work or spray it on before I would go out and this was like my staple scent uh, it's literally just everything I'm gonna spray it on right now it's so good you're not supposed to go like this but I'm gonna do it anyways because it messes up the notes but whatever oh my god this smells so good I'm gonna go on the Nordstrom website real quick so I want to tell you guys what the notes are Oh, it smells so good. The top note is when you first smell a fragrance, when you first spray it on. It is pomegranate yuzu iced accord, which I don't know what that is. The middle note is probably about like a couple minutes after wearing it when it sinks into your skin and mixes with your pH and all that stuff. It's magnolia, lotus flower, and peony. Peony is literally my most favorite flower. It's the scent that I love the most out of all the flowers. Like you know when people smell flowers and they're like, mm, that smells really good. You know, like roses and stuff. I'm like, ugh, it doesn't really smell good. But when I smell peonies, it's like, ugh. Oh my god, it is one of my favorites. After the fragrance has set and has rounded out a bit and has kind of settled after a while, it has vegetal amber, I don't know what that is, a cashew, and musk. You guys already know I love musk. The style of this fragrance is fruity, floral, and musky, and it's totally true, it is all three. It's kind of like one of those fragrances that you can't go wrong with wearing day or night, and if you can't decide between a fruity, floral, or musky scent, this is something that you should get. Um, it's not sweet though, it's not like a flower bomb or something like that. And then the mood is sheer, sensual, and luminous, and it's totally true how they have explained it. The last thing that I got for Christmas was a combined gift. Well, I didn't really know about it, but my husband got it as well. We got the iPhone 12 Pro Max phones. We both got it in gold. We do the 256. We weren't really due for a new phone, and I didn't want to do an unboxing either because those are like just, everyone has already done one. You can just look it up, and there's so many other ones, and I'm not like a techie person. It is quite big though. I have ordered two phone cases already, and I'm gonna get a pop socket, so it'd be a lot easier for me, but I really do love this phone. You can see things a lot better. On the back, it is matte and it looks more of a champagne color, but when you turn it to the side, it's definitely gold. The camera is so bomb, you guys. The selfie camera is amazing. As you guys know, I take a lot of pictures for Instagram and stuff like that, and when you take that selfie, girl, it is so good. It literally gets everything without getting everything, if that makes sense. It's like the clearest camera selfie facing all that that i've ever seen it's totally worth it i really do love it all right guys so that is it for me i hope that you enjoyed this video if you did enjoy this video please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you guys got anything that i got for christmas let me know in the comment section down below or let me know what you guys got for christmas and what your favorite gift was whether it be spending time with family or something being of material i love having conversations with you guys that is it for me Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Same with other But before we do get my shoulders <laughs> And we put that weighted blank over blank. I'm very very big on the palette. Oh shit. I'm so sparkly now.